Hello friends, welcome back. If you want to know what are subtasks and how to create a subtask for a user story in Jira with example, then you are watching the right video. First, let us see the requirement breakdown structure in agile software development. Here, initiative is broken down into one or more epics and each epic is broken down into one or more user stories and each user story can be broken down into one or more subtasks. Friends, to know how to break down initiative to epics and epics to user story, please watch the related video in my channel. I have also put the link in the description. In this video, we will only see how to break user story to subtask. Now, let us understand the concept of subtask by looking into the car manufacturing process. As you can see, to manufacture one car, lot of different Work has to be done by different people like frame and door fitting by John, engine fittings by Peter, dashboard fittings by David, tires fitting by Alex, glass fittings by again by John, electric work by Robert. From this concept, we can realize that manufacturing a car is a main task and each of this work like frame and door fittings, engine fittings, dashboard fittings and so on can be considered as subtask. Only if all the subtask is completed, the main task is considered as completed. Even if one subtask is not completed, the main task cannot be considered as completed. To define each subtask is a piece of work that is required to complete a main task. The main task can be a user story. Each subtask can be assigned and tracked separately by team. Now, let us consider an example where we have a user story to develop a login functionality for student in school management software. Now, let us see how to create subtask for this story in Jira tool. As you can see, this is the user story written in Jira tool with all the required information like user story in the format, scope, precondition, non-functional requirement, acceptance criteria and the attached UX and UI screenshot. Friends, to know how to write a user story in Jira with all this required information, please watch the related video in my channel. I will also put the link in the description. Now, from this story, we can understand that we need to develop a login functionality for student where student can log in and use the school management software. Now, let us see what all subtask is required to fulfill this story. Click on add a child issue. Here, we can create subtask for the story. The first subtask we can create is front end UI creation task, which involves work like designing the login page, inputting the username and password, and displaying error message when user provides invalid credentials. The next subtask we can create is front end test cases task, which involves writing the test case by the front end developer and verifying if all the test cases is working successfully. Next subtask we can create is Backend database task, which involves designing the table structure to store the username and password of the student and writing the store procedure. The next subtask we can create is backend application task which involves communicating with the database and validating the username and the password and allowing or rejecting the user to enter the software. The next subtask we can create is backend test cases, which involves writing the test cases by a backend developer and verifying if all these test cases is successful.
Now, the next subtask will be deployment. Deployment is a process where the developed functionality of this user story is moved to testing server so that the QA member can start testing the story. And the next subtask will be QA subtasks which involves testing by a QA member. He will test if the story is working fine according to the scope and the acceptance criteria of the story. As you can see, we have created seven subtasks for the story. Now, each subtask will be assigned in the name of the member who will work on that subtask. Click on the user icon and please assign the member for each subtask in this way. Once all the assignment is done, the respective members will start working on their subtasks. Only if all the subtask is done and completed, the main story is considered as done. Thank you friends. Please like, share and subscribe to the channel.